An investigation is underway tonight into circumstances surrounding the death of a local coal miner. It happened Tuesday afternoon inside a mine near the Schuylkill Dauphin County line. And that's where Eyewitness News reporter Mark Hiller brings us our update. It's not often these days we hear of deaths in the mine in northeastern Pennsylvania, but sadly, tragedy happened at one at the top of that mountain here in this part of Schuylkill County. At the top of Mountainside and Colliery Roads lies Williamstown Mine Number no. 1, owned by Kimmel's Mining Company. It sits high above a neighborhood in Williamstown, which exists at the base of the mountain. We do observe the miners going up and down. Uh, we usually see them probably around 3 o'clock in the afternoon come down, and of course they're covered in coal dirt. But on Tuesday afternoon, one of those miners didn't come down alive. Investigators say 37-year-old Daniel Shaner was working 1,000 feet below surface when a rock fell on him and trapped him. I witnessed the emergency vehicles going up the hill. Rescue crews freed Shaner, but it was too late. Police say the Donaldson man died from blunt force trauma. DEP officials and representatives of the mine were back on the scene 24 hours after the fatality, but declined comment. And it's very tragic. and. My family, I've grew, I, I grew up in this area, and I know way, way back my family was in the mines, and they were coal miners, and it's kind of phased out where there are only a few gentlemen that do this anymore, and it is very dangerous. Pennsylvania State Police are treating this case as an accidental death investigation. In Porter Township, Schuylkill County, Mark Hiller, Eyewitness News. Besides state police and DEP, Mine Safety and Health Administration and Pennsylvania Bureau of Mine Safety are part of that investigation.